Okay, today we're going to look at a Federated Auto Parts oil filter, number PG4476F. And it's made in India. So let's get at it. It looks like it's have a metal except for it's supposed to Okay, let's see what this filter looks like. First off, it says leak tested. I believe that's a date code. It shows the filters that it replaces. You got your Delco, Fram, Champ, k and Purelator, Valvoline, Wix. It says made in India right on the filter. It's got a nice plastic covering. I believe this would help it from not rusting, you know, inside if you got moisture around. You have eight inlet holes. I see a bypass valve down there and metal core. So let's open her up and see what's inside. Okay, here she is cut open. Get your nitro O-ring. Comes off fairly easy. It's your typical base plate though. You get your neutral anti-drain back valve. And it's got some twist to spring to it, but it's it's what it feels like. It doesn't feel too flexible like a silicone one. And your filter media here, I counted 51 pleats. I couldn't find a seam. You know, it seems like it'd be here somewhere. It, probably when I cut this open, I'll see something. And you get your metal end caps. Metal core. Bypass valve here. And that's just got a setting of 14 to 17 PSI. The filtration is supposed to be 96% 20 microns. And this is supposed to be an enhanced cellulose media. The width on it I got was just over one and three quarters. Like maybe one thirteenth, sixteenth, something like that. And let's see, the can itself. There's get this. Got a uh, spring, coil spring here. This is nice. Keep everything nice and tight. This is actually a pretty nice one. A little bigger than most of them. Got this zero off and we'll check this can. I was getting um, about 0 0.5, 0 0.4. Actually, yeah, it depends where where you get it, where you measure it from. But yeah, this one seems a little bit thicker than most most cans. Most of them are around 0.3. So, nice, it's got a nice thickness to it. Sturdy filter here. Yeah, so um, let's open this baby up and see how long she is. Okay, I cut this filter open. I figured I'd show you guys this. It's got a crimped seam on the inside. Get this crimped metal seam on the inside of the filter <laughs> instead of the outside, which is kind of a unique design. It's flipped around. <laughs> That's why I couldn't find a seam. See? All right, let me stretch this out and we'll see how long she is. Okay, here she is all laid out. She's 41 and a half inches long. Okay, and this was cool with the crimped metal seam on the inside. Overall, this filter is nice. The 
pleats are all nicely spaced, no ex excessive glue. Nice coil spring. Nice metal core. These big holes. Yeah, it's a pretty well made filter. Um, I'm sure it'd go 5,000 miles, no problem. Yeah, that's about it for this filter. Hey, if you liked the video, give me a thumbs up, like, subscribe, and hit that bell. Thanks for watching, and take care. And keep on wrenching. Ah!